Along with leptin is another hormone that changes. It's called insulin-like growth factor hormone, IGF-1. Now, all of us here have IGF-1 secreted when we're going through puberty. That's why we grow. But these individuals who are called uh, Laurent, they have Laurent syndrome, also known as Laurent dwarfism, do not secrete IGF-1. They're found exclusively in Ecuador and Spain. Now, here's the kicker. Even though many are obese, they never develop diabetes or cancer. And science believes this is due because, to their low, because of their low level of IGF-1. So they went on to study and they found that fasting also reduces IGF-1 by 50% after just five days. And when people return to eating, and this wasn't even returning to a healthy diet, but just returning back to the regular diet, the effects of IGF-1 still were reduced for 25 days, as low as 20% below baseline. Imagine if we were able to maintain it for a longer period of time. So this is really an insinuation that fasting or fasting-type diets, and there is a difference between the two of them, reduce the risk of diabetes and cancer.